Hey friends, welcome to my video. Today in this video, we are going to talk about how to install SQL Server Management Studio step by step. Yes, this is my part three video of how to install MSBI step by step. If you have not seen my part one and part two video, that is how to install Visual Studio 2019 or SQL Server 2017 step by step, then I request you to go and watch my both the videos that is part one and part two videos the link of the both videos are given in the description box you can find it in my description box below this video and if you know how to install visual studio and sql server 2017 you can get started with this video because in this video we are going to talk about how to install sql server management studio step by step so friends let's get started with this video this is your host Gurunath Adogi from OnlineBuff.com. So hey friends, as you can see, we have successfully downloaded the setup that is SSMS setup, you know, uh, which is which is of 528 MB. Okay, so I am just uh, clicking on this setup now to open it. So I just uh, double clicked on it, you know. So finally, yes. As you can see now, uh, the SSMS setup has been opened here, you know. So uh, here, as you can see, the Mic Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio installation begins here. You know, I just I need to uh, I need to just click on the install button to install it. OK, so uh, as you can see, the, the version is 18.1. OK, so I'm just going to click on the install button as the time availability on this youtube you know as a time uh, availability making of this video what i did you know uh, since it takes lot of time to uh, for installation so what i did to make it cut short you know to make you understand more easily i have, I have already installed my sql server management studio on my computer as you can see here you know sql server management studio is already been installed in my computer so i don't want to install uh, right now I will just show you the steps you know how to install it after clicking on this install button what will happen you know I will just show you uh, let me just close this so uh, after click on the install button it will take you to the installation process where where the package has where the packages uh, gets downloaded you know so once everything is downloaded it's pretty simple that that is the setup is going to get complete you know all the components have been installed successfully that kind of message you, you are going to get on your screen just close that and uh, you know just close that and do the restart you know i recommend after every setup you know after you complete the visual studio setup after you complete the sql server 2000 setup just do the restart after every setup is gets completed you know after this setup also what i did you know i just uh, restarted my computer then i clicked on my sql server management studio let me just show you i just clicked on my sql server management studio so it has been opening up now my version is 17.9.1 you know uh, uh, when I was doing the download, I got this version. Right now, it is 18.18.0 version. So, uh, whatever version is there, as you can see, the the screen looks something like this, you know, of SQL Server Management Studio. So, I'm going to connect this now with the Windows Authentication mode. As you can see, it has been connected successfully. As you can see on the left hand side, you can see my databases. You can see my uh, the tables and everything so uh, this is how you need to do the installation also for the same that is first you need to do the sql server 2017 setup then you need to download this sql server management tool from this url okay so once it's done you can you, know, you can also able to get this kind of screen you know this kind of management studio where you can write the queries where, can, where you can do lots of stuff you know so this is how uh, you need to do the SQL Server Management uh, Studio setup. Now we will go and download our SSDT, our last setup, you know, that is nothing but our uh, MSBI setup where we are going to get our integration services, uh, where we are going to get the analytical services, where we are going to get the reporting services. Let's go and download the SSDT. Hey friends. 
Now we are going to continue this video in our part 4 section where we are going to see and learn how to install SSDT step by step. So stay with us in our part 4 section of this video where we are going to learn and see how to install SSDT step by step. So hey friends hope you like this today's video that is how to install SQL Server Management Studio step by step. If you have any doubts or qu any queries regarding this video you can post your doubts and queries below the comment box of this video and uh, I am going to reply whatever doubts and queries you have on this installation process. If you really like this video then don't forget to give the big fat thumbs up and uh, do subscribe to my channel if you want to know more if you want to learn more about msbi step by step so thank you for watching this video have a nice day